down feeding the rams. And I have four. It's like Alfie has finally died. I've been feeding them a really good diet, but he was just a skeleton. He was getting vitamins, minerals, everything. So these boys are all fine. He's looking a bit skinny, but he's old. He's very old as well, Buster. The other ones are looking well because they're getting the old man's diet. Um, the old man diet consists of alfalfa, sugar beet, and rolled barley. So they're getting a good diet down here. So it's really sad to see Alfie. I'll have to release this ram lamb who's being an absolute aegis. You've been here all night, haven't you, you silly monkey? <sighs> Poor Alfie. He was such a... Oh, you're still alive! Alfie, you're not doing well. Okay. Oh. Okay. I thought you were dead. I thought for sure you were dead. I'm going to go get you some food. Hey, old man. You're still alive. Oh my God. There, would you like that? I'm gonna go get you some water too. Here, I'm gonna put that there and I'm gonna go get you some water. You're an old fella, aren't you? You're not doing great. He's an old, old man. Okay, getting you some water. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to call end of the road for Alfie. I'll have to get the knacker man to put him down, I'm afraid. It's a quick bolt to the head, but um, it's the quickest way to do it. He's just, he's getting delicious food, or has been. Yeah. Oh, here, fella. Oh, Jesus. Okay, you're standing up. Good man. You're going to fall over again. They can get bloat if they lie down on their side too long. Oh, Alfie, you're so skinny. You're skin and bones. When sheep get old, they lose their teeth. And no matter what you do, you can't feed them. The, the food doesn't digest properly when they don't have um, enough teeth. Because it doesn't grind it down and then they can't chew the cud properly. So you can see he's an absolute skeleton. So it actually would be better to call the knacker man and uh, get him to put Alfie down and take him away. I was trying to get him through to summer grazing and get a potentially another season out of him, but poor fella. I've been giving him oral doses of vitamins and minerals and everything, but it's just not working. So I'll have to get the knacker man to come. Poor Alfie. I might see if I can get him some rich tea biscuits. Those are his favorites. See if he'll eat that. He's just not interested in food. So I think it's getting close to calling it time for poor Alfie. Yeah, poor boy. Okay, yeah. I'll go get some rich tea biscuits and hopefully you'll have some, and then I'm afraid I'll have to say goodbye to you. You're such a good man. He's such a gentle, sweet, nicest ram I've ever had. So this is very, very sad. Very sad indeed. Poor Alfie. All these lads are in pretty good nick. Buster's slightly showing his spine, but he's old as well. So that'll be my two old boys.
I don't know if Buster will make it into the new year. I mean, sorry, the new breeding season. But um, these three boys are getting really well fed because I'm feeding them all on a diet for the two old boys, Buster and poor old Alfie. Okay, I'm gonna go get you some rich tea biscuits and hopefully you'll eat a rich tea biscuit. Oh, poor old man. It's very sad. Such a fantastic ram. Well, here are all the boys. And Alfie's come close to the gate and I brought him his favorite biscuits. So I'm waiting for the knacker man to come. So I'll see if Alfie will eat some of these biscuits. So these are Alfie's favorite biscuits. He's not well. He really is just dying. Would you like one of them? Can you smell it? It's your favorite biscuit. No? Alfie. Poor boy. You're such a good boy. Would you like a biscuit? Yeah, you like biscuits. You want a biscuit? There you go. No, Buster, can you go back? There you go. You guys have biscuits. Alfie, I'm so sorry you don't like your biscuit. You're just not well enough for the biscuit. Ah, oh, Lord. Well, the man's coming and we're gonna put Alfie down. It's very, very sad. He's produced some of my best lambs. He's been with me for 10 years. He was national champion. It's really, really sad. And such a kind, good-hearted sheep. He's walked right out the gate with me. Now we just have to wait here on the side of the road for the man to come and uh, put him down. It's just, he's too old. And it's just not fair on him keeping him alive any longer. I've done everything I can for the old man. It's very sad. Yes. Very sad. Buster and Alfie have been buddies ever since um, I've had them. Buster was born here. Alfie I bought in. The other sheep are kind of nibbling at the rich tea biscuits, but rich tea biscuits were really Alfie's thing. So sad I can't give him one. Or rather, he doesn't want to eat one. You're such a good man. You're such a good man. He's just not well. It's a much nicer, kinder thing to put him down now. You're a good man. Yeah. You good man. Oh, I'm gonna be so sorry to see you go. You're such a kind, good ram. Whoops. Sorry, I didn't know you were leaning on my hand, scratching you, and I took it away. I apologize. Poor fella. You good man. You good man. Yeah. You good man. Best buddy buster. You good boy. Yeah, Alfie. You good boy, Alfie. 